Hello and welcome back to Simply Shaker. Tonight on Simply Shaker, we have someone who has been one of the most popular and beautiful actresses of Indian cinema. Someone who has vacillated between extreme popularity and extreme anonymity. Interestingly, it is for the first time ever in the last two decades that she is making an appearance on any show anywhere. And indeed, it is for the first time ever we are making an exception to venture out of our sets to spend some very, very special moments with her. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the magical, mystical and mesmerizing Parin Bhabha! Parin, welcome on the show and thank you so much for consenting to come on Simply Shaker. Well, thank it, you for having me, Shaker. It's such a privilege and it's such a privilege to see you, you in flesh and blood, in oh, your well. entire splendor. You look so pretty, so beautiful. Thank you so much. Yeah. You, look, I must, you look pretty good yourself. Thank you. Thank you. When you started the film, I think you are one of the finest comic talents the Indian film industry has ever seen. I remember that scene when you were made of the and then you put it on your head. Yes. 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 उस वक्त कॉमिक राइटर्स नहीं थे इतनी खूबसूरत टाइमिंग के साथ आपने कैसे ये सब किया यू सी आई वॉज अ वेरी वेस्टर्नाइज गर्ल ऑलवेज माई सेल्फ इमेज वॉज वेस्टर्नाइज आई लुक वेरी वेस्टर्नाइज एंड सो देर वर नॉट वेरी मेनी इंडियन रोल्स दैट आई कुड प्ले और वेरी इंडियन सेंटिमेंट्स दैट आई कुड प्ले एंड देन आई वॉज अ ग्रेट एविड हॉलीवुड मूवी वॉचर एंड हॉलीवुड यूज टू डू ग्रेट कॉमेडीज एंड आई हैड अ सोर्ट ऑफ इंस्टिंग फॉर फॉर कॉमेडी एंड आई हैड लव फॉर कॉमेडी की थी जो आपको याद है जो आपके पसंद आई थिंक देर वॉज अ मूवी कॉल दूर देश विच इज नॉट अ वेरी वेल नोन मूवी बट आई हैड ग्रेट फन डूइंग इट आई हैड इनॉमस फन डूइंग इट बिकॉज इट वॉज राज बाबर वॉज देयर बट इट वॉज अ सब्जेक्ट अबाउट अ गर्ल हु वॉज अ यू नो सोर्ट ऑफ अ रियली व्हीलर डीलर खुकी टाइप ऑफ गर्ल एंड सो इट वॉज ग्रेट कैरेक्टर टू फील बहुत खुशी की बात है प्रवीण की आप मुझे कॉम्पिटिशन देने वाली है और कॉम्पिटिशन सिर्फ आप एक मामले में मुझे नहीं दे सकती है मिरर के मामले में ये जो परवीन भाभी जो ये मिरर इस्तेमाल कर रहे हैं उसका साइज देखिए बड़ी बड़ी स्टार रह चुकी है और अभी भी है स्मॉलर देन शेखर सिमेंस एंड दैट इज वी आर गोइंग टू किल इच अदर फॉर दैट यू नो दिस मस्ट बी टोल्ड इन शो बिजनेस टर्म्स इन फिल्म इंडस्ट्री देर वॉज ऑलवेज अ बिग जोक अबाउट यू नो इफ यूर अ बिगर स्टार देन यू कैरी द बिगर मिरर एंड मिस्टर शत्रुघ्न सिन्हा whose ego is huh. not the star of the <laughs> mirror mirror used to carry the largest mirror and we all used to laugh and uh, uh, my uh, ego uh, uh, was so secure that i could do with uh, the littlest mirror and you know par sabse bada dharam ji ka mirror kitna bada not i don't remember his mirror but i do remember shatrughan sinha's mirror bahut bada tha huge mirror you see guys this big mirror Ah, so, oh, just, just, just before the shot, Shekhar and I, Shekhar pulled out his mirror, and I said, "Oh my God, you know, this is a bigger mirror than me." Mirror, mirror. Uska mirror, mirror, mirror. So big. But you know, there, there was a, uh, why I had bought this mirror is because there was an inscription written here saying, "You are gorgeous." <laughs> and so, so I had sweet. picked this up from Harrods, uh -huh. and I said, "Well, you know, I'm going to show this to Shatrughan Sinha in front of him." <laughs> मेरे मेरे पे लिखा होता यू आर द वर्स्ट ताकि मैंने कहा इसको हमेशा सामने रखूं ताकि सतह पर रहूं जमीन पे बहर बहरहाल हम लोग एक टीवी शो के बारे में बात कर रहे थे जो आप करना चाहते हैं जहां आप होस्ट करेंगे किस तरह का टीवी शो होगा समथिंग एंटरटेनिंग इंटेलिजेंट क्रिएटिव इंटरेस्टिंग प्रोग्रेसिव एंड एंटरटेनिंग गुड एंटरटेनमेंट से मुझे याद आया आप मुझे कह रही थी कि आप स्टैंडर्ड प्रोटीन करते हैं लेकिन आप मुझसे बेहतर स्टैंडर्ड प्रोटीन कर सकते हैं क्योंकि आपके पास ऐसे ऐसे जोक्स हैं जो मेरे पास नहीं और आप कुछ सुनाना चाह रही थी व्हाट इज द बिगेस्ट जोक यू हैव एवर हर्ड आई आई थॉट द बिगेस्ट जोक ऑफ द मिलेनियम वॉज अमिताभ बच्चन बींग नॉमिनेटेड द स्टार ऑफ द मिलेनियम यू नो सुपर सीडिंग मिस्टर मार्लन ब्रांडो मिस्टर एलविस प्रेस्ली 
uh, Sir Lawrence Olivier, Sir Alec Guinness, <laughs> Michael Jackson, <laughs> I uh, mean Elvis everybody, Presley. Elvis Presley, just you name them. Amitabh Bachchan. And the bigger and joke, and, and even bigger joke was when Mr. Amitabh Bachchan was nominated the 10th most handsome man of the Indian century. <laughs> now, with all due respect, Mr. Amitabh Bachchan has always been known for his acting, not for his appearance. I don't understand that I'm crying or crying. I think if it happens, people have said that people have voted in favor of voting, polling. In Indian century, there have been men who can be called good-looking. Yeah. Handsome men, you know, such as Devan and Firuz Khan, Shami Kapoor, Shashi, Shashi Kapoor, Kapoor, even Raj Kapoor, or even Rishi Raj Kapoor, and uh, uh, of course Dharmender, yeah. and uh, oh, there are innumerable, uh, there are so many. Karan Kapoor, Shashi Kapoor's son, these have been uh, some of the most good looking men. Even Sanjay Gandhi was yeah. a better looking man than Amitabh Bachchan. <laughs> Uh, there have been innumerable, extremely good-looking men. And so, uh, you know, for Amitabh Bachchan to be voted one of the ten most handsome men of Indian century, I thought that was, that just took the bakery, <laughs> as they say in stand-up beauty. Yes, took the bakery and the baker's daughter. Now, what do you want to do? What do you want to do? What do you want to do? Now, I have, uh, I am uh, filing a petition with the Honorable Supreme Court in respect of the TADA situation. Yes. My evidences which have been, uh, I have not been permitted, uh, the opportunity which I should have been permitted. So I am going to the Supreme Court with that. I am doing interior design. I have been doing interior oh, design yes, professionally. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and uh, um, personally I like interior decorating. Mm -hmm. It's much more vast and complex and interesting. Uh, so uh, that is what I do, and then I write. I write in in the fields of philosophy. Parveen, if you had to address life or express life in a lighter vein, what would it be? How would it be? What would you say about life in a lighter vein? You know, life uh, uh, in in little more uh, serious terms is is the most precious uh, most precious uh, phenomena on the face of this earth, and we must respect it, yeah. we must cherish it. If yeah, we have we it, must. we must thank God for it, Absolutely. and we must make the best of it, I think, Absolutely. in the positive way. You know, today we have become very unscrupulous and coarse and people in society. We think that achievement through completely valueless means is, is achievement, and it's, it's living life to the fullest. Yeah. I don't think so. And as I think the very living rightly said, Parveen, that life is something that happens to you when you are busy with everything else. So I would not that want that to happen to you or to me or to anybody else. I think life is something to be cherished and to be enjoyed and to be yes. savored. Yes. And I think you are doing just that. On that note, I think it's a very positive. I say thank, thank you, you very so much. much. And I'm thinking that privilege. Thank you. 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 So much. Thank you. This is the most charming gentleman I have met.